My name is Jess Singh. I'm 15 years old. Um, I would like to improve my cricket, mainly in the batting, uh, mainly in batting, because when I'm batting, I am not confident enough to play a shot. I give myself op myself an option uh, of two shots or three shots whenever I have it, instead of just taking the first one that comes to my mind and and playing it and freeing my arms. And um, another weakness while batting is the short ball. I tend to uh, cramp myself up. I don't free my arms and, and pull the ball a lot. I, I tend to shuffle backwards and play the ball in front of me. Um, it's, a, it's a mental issue and I believe I can pull the ball. I just need to work mentally in the nets um, by having somebody start with just throwing a, a like a heavy tennis ball, soap tennis ball, and then slowly moving on to hard ball bowlers. So just that I pull the ball, and uh, I mentally I, I realize that I can hit the ball hard in that zone. Bowling wise, I think uh, what I want to do first is now build up more pace, and because I feel like my line is is beginning to come well, I also need to start working on uh, something that a past coach. Told me, which I'm trying to, which I've been trying to work on this entire tour, is that my back foot is landing square rather than straight, and this will give me problems in my back <coughs> in future, uh, in the future. So I need to work on that a lot, uh, bowling wise. I would also like to work on my fitness, my overall fitness, and I will do that by jogging, skipping, and. Uh, a workout routine that I have every day, which I can do in my own home. And it will just help me build my core strength. And I will, in general, be able to have a, uh, be a better cricketer because I am able to hit the ball harder, bowl faster. <coughs> How do you like this tour? I How enjoyed, was your tour? I enjoyed this tour very much, sir. No, not because we are saying to you. We are no, really, I enjoyed the tour. How have you enjoyed it? It's just been a really, really fun tour. I don't know. It's playing a lot of cricket is has been always one of my dreams, because just playing cricket, playing cricket every day is something I've been looking forward to. And before I came here, in fact, in Switzerland, I've been, I was nervous almost to come here and play for because last year we played almost nine hours a day, and that that was just something that I really um, aspired to have. Because nine hours a day of cricket is just building your body towards becoming a better cricketer every single day. What was it? Uh, uh, low points in the tour, like you feel that anyway, you know, this is not not like last year. Do you think that it's the same uh, intensity we played or what do you think? Your strength suggestion on that? Mm, I think last year there was a little bit more, let's constantly play cricket idea because even in the evenings we would ask you can we go play this can we go play cricket can we go to the nets and play here and we used to play until nearly nine in the evening every single day and that, that was one thing I, I quite miss because we, we had quite, quite a few fun games like the Cindy's non Cindy's after <laughs> and I really enjoyed those matches so I, I really want those to come back so that was probably one of the low points. So how do you think about this indoor while sitting here? See, we didn't play matches because maybe some of the boys are not ready to play or maybe they are tired quickly. And then we have this indoor sitting down, writing a book and discussing on the board. Do you think this is good or Sir, is it necessary? I do think it is good because in, I say this personally because in Switzerland, we don't do a lot of this preparation. We show up on the spot, we elect somebody as captain and they play. And often, oftentimes the captains have no structure or plan. They just say, oh, you're the best bowler, you're the best batsman, go. Do your thing. And being in this camp, um, it really, and with all of this um, classroom time, let's call it, um, I feel like it's really improved what I know is in the sport, so how much I can plan ahead for the match. Even if other people don't, I can plan it for myself. 
and that that was probably the main learning for me. Was it better uh, not playing up to eight thirty and doing something? Sit down and think about it. I think it was it was good, but I still enjoy the games more. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, I think we had a good show. Uh, though you said we missed out three games, but this is now really for the modern. Because you play cricket, that's yeah. one because uh, I think the world language is very good. Less, they're not as few like class. Yeah. And uh, overall, I uh, think you as a bowler, you perform very well. And what you are talking here, on that, I would like to speak to you now. That you don't have to well, think about your body. I think about the body that you you are lacking somewhere. Think about what you know in batting. So what one that first thing talk about. Yes, and yes, you do practice for that, but your core thing is, is you, you are a bowler at 15 if you are going to be so well. I can only suggest you to bowl close to the stump, or if you have noticed yesterday also when you play your game, you bowl close to the stump, and bowl of the stumps in terms of keeping the stump, I think you are very disappointed. And if you bowl that, no batsman in the Switzerland cricket can be disappointed, trust me. And that's very important. Other than bowling outside the option, I, I, whatever you do, do it with heart and enjoy it. Yeah? Yes, sir. Okay. So, today I batted and scored 18 in 12 balls. I also bowled four overs for 14 runs. I felt it was a very good day for me because the ball came nicely onto the bat. Today I felt good about the match, however, I would like very much to have a training slash net session in the near future so that I can hone in my batting skills. Excluding most of the cricket, today was much longer and more difficult. I now realize that I have to pace myself to be able to get through the week. Also, the food is generally good, and there is sufficient variety in it to keep me interested. I feel like noting down each food. I feel like noting down each food to see if anything reappears during the 12 to 13 days that remain. Today, I have made a fairly big mistake. I forgot to ask Gopal sir if I could use my phone to text my parents. They must. They must get worried, but I will reassure them by calling tomorrow. Today I also discovered that the showers are very nice downstairs from my room. I honestly believe that I will use them much more often if I cannot go swim in the afternoon. Swimming is not a necessity, but it might be good to relax the muscles a little. Oh well, until tomorrow, my birthday awaits. From? I'm from India, and I live in Switzerland. Day 9, 13th of August. Today started fairly usual. I went to Nishad's room at 7 o'clock in the morning to wake him up and went to brush my teeth. Again the morning went as usual until I remembered that Karthik was sick the night before. I went to his room to check on him and he was sound asleep. It was around 8.10 so I let him take his time to get ready before coming to breakfast. Soon afterwards, however, my focus switched topics and I looked forward to the game today. Gopal sir called us for a meeting after breakfast and we discussed the teams for today's matches against uh, MP Academy. I was on the list to play the first match in the morning. We bowled first and I opened with South. I bowled decently with three overs for seven runs and I bowled one maiden. We restricted them to a score of 105 with only one batsman from their side retiring. Fortunately, our batsman did well enough and we ended up reaching the total in a mere 16 overs. Next, I was looking forward to a net session. However, I came to find out that the session had been cancelled. I really wanted to have a video recording of myself bowling and batting so I can work on my technique later on in Switzerland. So instead of nets, I umpired the second game and I witnessed Manaswin get seven wickets and one hat trick and all the wickets were bowled. That side was a good replacement for the net session. Oh well, I can only hope for another net session, but I am looking forward to going to Ramadan and browsing the store. Hopefully I will get to go soon.